Alright Internet, Miss Knickknack here and we're going to follow on with something we did in the last video. So in my previous video I did people and people who annoy me and just my pet peeves in general. So I had a bit of inspiration from that video because I was thinking about things that I kind of thought were a pet peeve but they're actually just things that generally gross me out and disgust me. So I thought I'm going to make a video about things that gross me out and some of them are probably very traditional, others I think I'm just weird for finding disgusting. So let's talk about what grosses me out and why I'm singing. First of all, I I have never been good with bugs in general. Like I'm getting itchy, like even thinking about it. But I have a thing. Oh god, making me really uncomfortable. Um, I have a thing with like centipedes. They I don't know what it is. I think it's the amount of legs. They genuinely scare the shit out of me. Like. We once did, when, back when I was in college, they did a dance to, I think, was it a piece of music called Centipede? I don't know. Anyway, they had this video of these, it was actually called Centipede, they had this video of a giant centipede in the background, and I flipped the fuck out. It was in the middle of an assessment, and I ran out and had to stand outside until it was over, because I was like actually having trouble breathing. I can't explain why it freaks me out. I'm just not good with bugs. I'm just really, I can't, like, people are like, go fly. People watch shows like I'm a Celebrity Get Me Out of Here. Oh, I literally can't. I, oh, I just have got to see what happens. See what happens when I talk about bugs. Freaks me out. Back when I was in Malta a few uh, months ago, Sam was performing a gig at a metal festival, and I went to, like, go watch, as a girlfriend does. And I was backstage, and they were basically, it was, right, first of all, this was a heavy metal concert. I was totally out of my element, but they were putting, it was set in a, uh, what do you call it, like an abandoned prison. So it was already creepy as shit, but they were like, yeah, let's just go put all the equipment, have to go in this old gym. Which basically looked like kind of like the thing from high school music school, but with all the lights off. But anyway, Sam didn't want to go to the toilet and he didn't really want to go to the Porta Luz outside because it was packed. So he was like, I'm sure there's going to be one in here. This place was pitch black, by the way. We were like walking around it with torches. We found this one toilet. It was very clean, everything. The lights worked, but there was no toilet paper. So we were like, oh, there's one on this side of the gym. There's got to be one on the other side of the gym. So we went over there and I'm using my phone torch, as you do, like this on the floor. He, we get to the other side and suddenly, huh, I see a cockroach run past my foot. and. I have never seen one in person until this moment. So I was like, what was that? And then I saw a second one run past. And as I suddenly noticed what was going on, Sam hit the light switch and they scattered. I'm so itchy. They scattered everywhere. So I look at him and I'm like, get out of there! And he looks at me thinking there's like a murderer behind him and I literally jump over this barrier where the seats are and I'm like, running for my life. So I pretty much refused to go, I'm so itchy now, I pretty much refused to go backstage for the rest of that thing because just no, just no. So yeah, bugs in general, they gross me the fuck out. Anyway, a uh, second thing that weirds me out, which is very specific to me. I know people have, uh, sorry, I'm thinking think about it. People have a thing about like scraping uh, forks on like plates and yeah that kind of wrong but I have a thing that like touch things because I've got quite long nails at the moment but if you're god I can barely even talk about this it's freaking me out so much like you know like photo paper like really shiny thick photo paper and if I touch it with my fingers uh, <laughs> like if your fingernail scrapes down it it actually does something to my body that with especially if I, it's, it's the same as if I hear like a loud squ uh, squeaky sound. I once opened some treats for my dog and as I opened the packet it squeaks and it was such a, oh god I'm so itchy now, it's such a weird frequency of sound that I actually gagged. It was, I don't know what it is, my body reacts weirdly to like high pitched squeaky sounds and touching my nails on my open but I don't know what it is! what it is 
but it makes me so uncomfortable. I can't even put it into words. But this is another thing that's very specific to me, and I know I'm gonna have to get over it someday, but I ha- oh my god, I- I really have a hard time washing up in the sink, because if I'm washing up and food that's been left on the plate touches my fingers, Oh my god. I am putting this down to back when I was a brownie, when I was younger, which if you're in America, it's kind of like the scouts but for girls. Uh, back when we did that, I was doing a camp and they made us wash up and it was always like cold food. It's like cold water, we were using a tub and like, if you ever touch food or something. I don't know, I've just developed a really weird fear of it, like a, a fear I can't even explain of like touching wet food. It just sets me off in general like if anything like even like taking stuff out the dishwasher i think it's just if it's like water that touches my hand but it's not clean i'm just not about it i just hate it it makes me go all weird and i just want to like oh yeah this is one thing that it's just to me that i find really annoying and it freaks it just doesn't freak me out it just grosses me out mentally is um if you're sitting next to someone and they have a cold and they just keep sniffing and I, I get it, I know colds are horrible and they can come and hit you at the worst most awkward moments but for the love of God, if you were in a situation where you were sniffing constantly and you can't go find somewhere to blow your nose, I want to punch you in the face. <laughs> it is the most disgusting frustrating thing in the world. I understand, I've been in that situation where I've had a runny nose and I haven't had a tissue, but I will like try and go out of my way not to sniff because I know how disgusting it sounds. So yeah, just stuff like that just really grooved. I think I just have a thing with bogeys. I think they just, or boogers, however you call them. They, I just think it's gross. I don't know. I don't mind if it's my own, but if it's other people, I don't know why I get really weird about it. I just think it's disgusting. <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, that was my list of things that I find really disgusting. I know they're really stupid and little things, but I think everyone has their own little things that they're actually genuinely disgusted by. Like, I never understand people who are afraid of feet. Like, I've, I've dated someone who had a fear of feet, and I find it a really odd thing to be weirded out about, but hey, that's just me. Anyway, not that that's a problem, I understand that everyone has their own little fears and stuff like that. So, like, guys, let me know in the comments if you have something really obscure that you're grossed out by. I think I'm just weird, really. So, uh, yeah, I hope you guys really enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!